speaker's corner now. We're in the corner now on, 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 on a segue from the questioning thing. You get me? Um, how you find out about speaker's corner? I don't know, but probably a video or something. Yeah. 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 Probably and a video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And how, how, how long, like when, when, when you first got exposed to it, what was, what was your thoughts of it? Like, I don't know. Like, like it, debates and that. And debates and conversations and that. I liked it. Yeah. Um, it's mad because I think I just naturally was just watching it. I don't know how long I'd been watching it, how long I'd been saying I don't really know this, the backstory of how I found out about Speaker's Corner Store. But, um, yeah. I thought, like, yeah, that's good. There's somewhere where people could chat and, like, boom, boom, boom. Let me hear where I go on. You get me? Yeah. Let me go and hear where I go on. What, 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 what like did that. you feel like? I don't know how, how much you was watching it, but um, in terms of the, the types of conversations happen, happening there, the way people was talking to each other, what was their take on it? Do you know what? Maybe because I never absorbed too much of the contents, I just saw the, the premise of what it was, so I never really got swayed of what to expect. Yeah. I've seen like um, Leo Mohammed and a couple other old school people, like, so obviously, okay. I don't even know then, when then I watched it. Was it was more of like a platform thing. Yeah, a platform and thing. And that was and audience. Yeah, yeah, so I didn't really know, but I just thought it's somewhere... I think I, I decided to start doing some vlogs and that's so I thought, you know what, it'd be good. Let me just take my camera down there, test out the camera and and see what, and capture what's going on down there. Yeah, what is that? Is that when the first time you come down there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. When I see you, man, yeah? Yeah, yeah. My thing. So what, so, so um, did you know about Speaker's Corner long before that or was that just like straight after you've been watching Leo Muhammad and that? Did, say that again? Did you know about Speaker's Corner long before you first came down or... Like was you watching the Leo Muhammad videos and then you came down? Yeah, yeah, no, I knew about it. Yeah, there was a, there was a, there was, there was a, a, a sizable amount of time. Yeah, yeah. and I, I, I couldn't tell you how many videos or how many different things I'd seen. Yeah. But you know what? I'd see, it, it'd actually been a while, to be fair, if I think about it, because when I first watched one of them videos, it was there. Yeah, it was years apart from when I actually went down there. It never even went in my head to, to, to yeah. go down there. Okay. Yeah. So when when you first got there, now what what, what was 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 it, was it like? Um, it's just mad loud and just bare mad man shouting and like screaming about their their religion and that, isn't it? Yeah. Sorry, do you, do you mind if I partake in... in Come on, fam. I'm going to say no, I'm sorry. you want, man? Sorry. Um, yeah, yeah, so what, what did you expect? Did you have any expectations when you like when you was actually on your way down there? Yeah. I thought I was going to see something excited, like something new. I had not been there, so you know, I was quiet. Yeah, I was gas. Yeah. It was a, I think it was a nice hot day. I was gas. Let me get down there and test out my little camera. Enjoyment, innit? Some yeah. me time. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so how was it when you got there? Um, yeah, it was manic. It was just madness. It was mad. The energy down there was like, it was thick. It was mad, but very interesting because I'm a people watcher, innit? So for me, I was in my element, just looking, recording. Got chatting, sort of met Abu Tala down there. Yeah, and we, you, 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 you got involved in conversation the first time you went down there, yeah? Um, I, can't, I can't even remember, you know, you'd have to play, I'd have to play about that video. I think I did, you know, yeah. I think that's when I, sp had a, I spoke to the Freemason guy and um, someone else, and Abu Tala and someone else still. Yeah. Yeah. And what, um, how, how did it go? Had the conversations? Um, yeah, interesting. Just fun, man. You know, that enjoyment. You know me. So, I was so, just, so you, were, you weren't talking that, you weren't getting mad serious or nothing like that. Like, just general chit chat. Yeah, but even chit chat, like, if we're. Even our chit chat's serious at times, isn't it? It's like, yeah. it's just. It is what it is. We're just talking. I just got into whatever conversations were available. Like, that, that like, was, interested me or whatever. And yeah. it was, was, the conversa was the conversations, would you say, productive? Like, was they flowing? Um, was you learning, sharing information? I suppose, yeah, or, or like, I don't know. Certain man, I was just hot in. Like, it just felt like I was just hot in, man. Like, I had my camera on, I was just gassed, and I was like, yeah, well, yeah, talk me about Freemasonry. Yeah, yeah, what, what, you know about Lucifer? No, yeah, job, you know, yeah. what degree, what degree? Like, you get me? But still, for me, I'm just happy that I'm filming something and it's on topics that are not about fucking bullshit. It's actually some form of information. So for me, I was, I was, I'm trying to just plug a gap that I don't see. I'm trying to provide the kind of material that I don't see, the stuff that I want to see, yeah. if you're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
So yeah. yeah, it was it was that was a good day, man. I was gassed. I was like, yeah, I'm definitely coming down there next week. You get me? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, that was good. So you seen your first your first week was cool, yeah, your first day. Yeah, 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 yeah. So um what was when when was the um when was the time that you came and saw Raspik? Was that the following week? When you when you chatted him? May have been on, the, on the camera on the COE. Yeah, 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 that may have been still, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's 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 I think I saw you the first time you came down still, but mm. obviously that I, I didn't I didn't hear you speak on mm-hmm. that still. But yeah, when 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 you first came and was chatting to Raspik. Yeah, that day that I, I bodied Raspik. <laughs> so, just drink my mineral water. So yeah. Yeah, yeah, I, I didn't even know Raspik. I didn't. I just seen him. I seen his music, and I don't think I really put the, the face to the music, but I was a fan of the music that I'd heard. And then I'd even seen that policeman bad up video from yeah. years back, and I was definitely a fan of that. You get me? And I suppose just the energies, but I didn't really, I didn't put it all together. You get me? Yeah. But yeah. Just chatting to him, and I just like the youth, man. I was like, my man's fiery, like. No, I'm saying, well, you saw, you saw him in the park and chatted to him. That's when. You yeah, that's the first time I met him. Okay, first yeah. First time I met him, but yeah. I knew of him, like I said, because I'd heard his tunes, I'd seen videos of him before. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. like, like for me, the, I don't know. The way my brain works is almost as if sometimes, unless something notable happens, where I'm gonna register who you are and your name, it may be that like I might be aware of you, but it doesn't actually register. Like, do you know what I'm trying to say to you? Yeah, from? yeah, yeah. But yeah, like I definitely heard that Ten Daimari thing it was a banger. So it's I was a banger, like, fam. You get me? I'm not even sure that when I was chatting to him, I even re- re- j- yeah, yeah, yeah. equated because I'm not sure I knew the name or whose tune it was. Yeah, I just know yeah, that yeah. tune's bad. So okay. Yeah. yeah so um, what 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 I liked about that that it was refreshing still because um, I think you remember like you you to me you you was like on this iconoclast thing, fam, where you, where you're just slapping down. <laughs> You're slapping down any type of idol- idolization. Is that what they call it? Iconoclast? Yeah. See? Yeah, that's that's when you challenge like cherished beliefs and all of that, you get me? Oh shit, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's 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 what you do. That's Is that what, what you do. got me down as, yeah? That's what I had you down as still. But you, me, I like that because it's like I believe that's how humanity gets to advance mm. when we question everything. Like and sincerely question it, not just try and shame man or Try and make a man feel a way or a, like put your emotions aside. Let's see if this thing what you're talking about is the truth or not in it. Okay, yeah. yeah Let's see yeah. if this idea what you're talking about is gonna benefit of us or not in it. Yeah, yeah. Let's yeah. test it in it. Yeah, Let's yeah. ask questions about it in it. If they're saying that's what it is, if they're saying that's the intention, exactly. to benefit everyone. Exactly. Mm-hmm. So obviously, man's on this Marcus Garvey thing. Yeah. I'm on this Marcus Garvey thing. I got the philosophies and opinions. What's the Mar- well. what's the Mar- Marcus Garvey thing? But well, what I mean when I say that yeah. still is like, um, I was gonna say hero, but then that it, it, it takes more um, description in it. Let's be real, man. Be sincere. I'm, 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 try, I'm trying to get it out still. I'm trying to get it out without using labels in it. I'm trying to be descriptive still, specific. Um, I know of Marcus, some of Marcus Garvey's ideas, and I cherish them in it, and I think that they can be applied today in order to benefit, man. Yeah, I can fuck with that, man. You get me? I can fuck with that, bro. Yeah. But I, I, I'm also aware that just like um, Barack Obama, some man just idolise the um, idea of a black president or in terms of Marcus Garvey, a black messiah. Man call him um, Moses. Man call him a prophet. Things like this, you get me? I don't, I don't know if he's introduced himself as that. I don't know if he's ever claimed to be them things. I feel like man can overhype up the, um, the, like, over glorify I call, him, I call them political celebrities. Yeah. You get me? <clears throat> yeah, but like, I feel like man and, can just. And they start worshipping. Yeah, it becomes idol worship I, 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 inadvertently. I, I, I feel like, I feel like then. Shirk. Ma, ma, shirk. shirk. Ma, ma, man, man pay more attention to the man than the ideas, is what I feel like. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. The yeah, idea yeah. is what you like. The, yeah, the yeah, message, yeah. what you were trying me- to get the, across again. The, the, they're in love with the messenger more than the message. That's that's the impression I get still. So I, I, I like to see, because I like to see anything ch- questioned. You get me? So yeah, w- when I saw that, um, that's what you was on. I don't know if I if I if I would have um, took the same route as you still. Okay. Car. Trying to trace back through my memory still and get specific with the thing, you know what I mean? But um, 
I don't know if you said fuck Marcus Garvey. <laughs> I don't know if you said fuck this Marcus Garvey or fuck Malcolm X or something like that. But I swear it was along them lines there, you get me like. But I know, well, I believed that what you was actually saying is the idolization of them, innit? I think, I, I think you specifically said, let, like, let's, instead of worshipping them and idolizing them or looking at them like they're the thing, let's be the thing, innit? Yeah, yeah. So I, think, I think that's what I was taking from it, you yeah, get me? Yeah. So, um, well taken, well taken. That's, that's exactly what I meant. Yeah. yeah, you know what? Sometimes you're harsh with your words, innit? Because it's, a, it's it, yeah, something, because you might be caught up in your passion, you might be not feeling sensitive to the other person's cherished beliefs, like you said, whatever. It, it is what it is, bro. Like, ask me on another day and I might give you a different way of being or a different way of expressing the same sentiment. The sentiment is there, the, the message is there, and the message is. Stop the idol worship, innit? Stop the idol worship. That's what that's what the whole message is. So I don't give a I don't give because really and truly most people are comfortable to burn out idols, innit? Yeah. The ones that they don't hold close, the ones that they don't the, yeah, the ones yeah, they yeah. don't they don't cherish. But once it's one that they cherish, they're not willing to throw that one into the fire just like the rest of them. Mm. So that's what I was just trying to point out. Yeah, man. So so what 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 what, what, what do you feel about the um the response you was getting, what type of response was you getting? Like, just a little backlash of like, you know, like, rah, oh, nah. Like, nah, like defense, innit? People want to defend the things that they love, and that, like, oh, nah, rare, rare. But then a lot of it was illogical. I, I, feel, I feel like he was getting attacked as well, though, as well. I swear, I swear, even I heard someone call Yaku. Yeah. I don't, yeah. know if I, I don't know if it was there. Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. There, there definitely has been some coons thrown about. And, um, I know in the forum and that store. You know, I mean, in poor the, sister, in the like that's that's her, her like I don't even know. There's the, what can I say, man? I don't feel like that's coonish at all, fam. I just feel like you lot just love to idol worship and just love to like put people up on pedestals, but you don't want to put yourself up on a pedestal and live the life that of of of, of self righteousness. Now I'm not preaching to you like I'm holy or like I'm without sin or whatever. None of that, but. I'm just simply pointing out the fact that, yeah, we can, we can be inspired by people and whatever. But you see, as much as you're praising the creation, you're not pra praising the creator. You might be um, praising the creator's works, but you're not praising the creator. The, 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 the all win it. So I feel like all of that just specific, put, raising up one man and just to the point where it's almost like a religious thing, you're trying to de and deify a human being again, I'm down with that. And that just goes across the board, we do it every day, celebrities, this, that, footballers, rah, 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 rah. all the energy that we give away and, and look, at the, look at the world or look at what, when I look around me, I see a need for people to give that energy to themselves. Do you know what I mean? That's what I see. Cause it's all like, it's all outgoing. It's like we've been programmed to be all outgoing, all of it's going outside of ourselves rather than within ourselves so and what, connecting us. What, what do you feel are the effects of having that type of mentality where you idolise other things? It's, it's, in a way, I, I, I think of it like you um, I feel they put people outside of themselves on a pedal stool to the point where they feel like there's no way of even coming halfway near accomplishing Those the things kind that of moves. Yeah, these yeah, yeah. people have done. A man said to me, like, yeah, you, like, not even one strand of your hair would compare to the works that <laughs> man has done very rare. I remember that hit me still. Yeah. I was like... I swear, I swear even, obviously man ain't like, religious or not, I'm still, but I remember hearing something about, I think Ty said it still, that um, it was Jesus said, um, after me, like, there'll be men who do better things than what I've done or something like that. Like as 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 a prophet, you get me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think yeah. Ty was saying I think he was saying he's better than Muhammad or something like that. <laughs> you get me? And he was just giving the example of like prophets Stuff telling you that telling you that like you can I'm a I'm a man in it, I'm a human being in it. Don't ever degrade yourself you to the level. Degrade yourself to elevate another man. Like as as if you're not capable. So, so now you're gonna go through your life and not do nothing because you feel like I, I, I can't aim that high in it. Because only yeah. only them man can do that. Yeah, yeah, only yeah. them gods there, them them demi gods yeah, can do that. I told that. you that's deification, and 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 I don't think you should do that for. A, for I don't. I, that's my opinion, isn't it? Other people they're comfortable with that, and some people wanna. I don't know. I'm just putting it out. 